Uh oh! What's up, guys? It's another Let's Play. We're doing Kirby's Adventure on the NES. I am so, so, so excited about doing this Let's Play. This is a big favorite game of mine. Um, I've actually got this game a long time ago for Christmas for my parents. So, thank you, Mom and Dad. This game is awesome. So, I figured. I haven't played this game in actually quite a long time. Um, I don't know, it must be, I don't know, 10, 11 years, but it's freaking awesome. Um, so this game, let's see here. For those of y'all who know, I'm a big Kirby fan, and, uh, you know, have any excuse to play a Kirby game, which is sad because I haven't played this game in so long. This is probably one of my favorite Kirby games. Um, there's actually been a kind of a resurgence in Kirby games lately. Um, I guess the latest one was the Kirby 20th advent 20th anniversary on the Wii, which is actually a really good game. Um, it has big collection on it, and this game is on there actually. But I think there's Kirby's uh, Kirby's Dream Land, Kirby's Dream Land 2, Kirby's Adventure, this one, and then Kirby Dream Land 3, which was on the Super Nintendo? Yeah, Super Nintendo. Super, I think there's six, seven games on there. What else is there? There's uh, Crystal Shards on 64, and then there is, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to do that mini game. Um, what was that one? Um, Superstar, the big collection of games on that, so, yeah, suck, screw it. Nope, never mind. Come back. So, anyways, for those of y'all who aren't familiar with this game, this is Kirby's... I got your cannon. Oh, I want that one. For those of you who are not familiar with this game, or even Kirby games, um, this is Kirby's first um, console game. The first game, this is actually his second game ever first game was uh, Kirby's uh, Dream Land on the Game Boy, and oh, that was stupid. Get out of here. This guy's really not that hard. Oh my god, really? I'm gonna die to this guy? I'm gonna get him. This is like your your screen clearing move. I can't believe I lost so much life to that guy. It's really easy. Oh, crazy Kirby kill! It's so fun. Now I'm gonna die though. So that's that's cool. Anyways, this is Kirby's second game, first console game. First game was on the Game Boy. And this this game allowed you to um. I need that, I need that. Sorry. This game allowed you to copy people, which is, you know, his trademark. The first game, the Game Boy game, you were not allowed to do that. So, um, for whatever that was worth, um, which makes this game a lot more fun because there's just a bunch of different people that you can copy. Now, you can't copy everybody, but, um, like that guy up there, he has a sword. That guy would give you the sword ability. So you suck it up, now you have the sword ability. So, pretty straightforward. I'm never good at this game. This little part. If you go all the way up to the top, you get a 1-up, which is pretty cool. Um, so, you finish a level and it opens more of the uh, world. Uh, this is a crane game, I think. This is kind of a mini-game. Get some little... Yeah, crane fever. Let's see how we do this. Go over to the big Kirby, because he's worth more points. Let's see if we can get him over. Let's see if we can get him. Uh, uh, ah, oh, crap. Hmm. All right, we're, we're gonna get him again. We're gonna try and get him again. I think he's worth two, two one-ups, and the little Kirby over there is worth one. But, hmm, yeah, totally got him. Take that. Yeah, I want a big Kirby. Two one-ups. Or two-ups. 
Nice. So, on level three, I'm trying to remember how... many worlds are on here? There's probably a good four or five. Take that. I think the sword is probably my favorite. Damn it. Um, my, my favorite uh, ability. There's a few other cool ones that are kind of harder to find. Like there's a wheel. That one's pretty cool. But this game is one of my favorites, especially for the for the regular Nintendo, the NES. Oh, this one you best by far. There's some, and the NES, the NES has some really good, oh, really good game. This one by far is. One of the favorites for sure. Hmm. Right, I'll breathe fire. And uh, this game is fairly simple. So if you're kind of a newer, newer gamer, newer to gaming, not very good at games, um, this one's probably one of the best ones to start out on. Um, it's very simple. It's one of those games where there's a lot of secrets, so it's not like just for easy, you know, people who suck at games. So just a and one is just a freaking awesome game, but I always suck at that. Um, <clears throat> really, really awesome game. You go through about uh, well, here's a museum. Museum showcases off um, an enemy that you can get. So this one's a sword guy. Oh. Really? I want the sword. You press the light to get rid of your ability, so that's how you do that. There we go. Cool. And what's cool is that you can also uh, replay levels again. I'm not going to replay it, but, you know. Which is cool. And you do have that fantastic Nintendo slowdown whenever you have a bunch of enemies on here. Here's a boss time. This guy gives you the freeze ability, which is pretty cool. You just suck them up and you get the freeze ability. You can turn people into uh, ice cubes and you can throw the ice cubes at people. Which is awesome. So, I mean, there's really not a bad ability in this game. There's some, I guess, that you'll enjoy more than others. But, I mean, it's, it's pretty cool to uh, just test it out and see what you can, uh, see what you like, preference-wise. It's just fun. That was stupid. Here? No, it disappeared. Ooh. I'm gonna take that. Okay. So at the end of. That's one of the. Uh, I wouldn't say a bad guy. I guess he's a rival. You'll see him later on. And he gave you kind of a one-up. Let me get this one up. Not that I'll need it, but... Oh, look at that frame raid. Just... That was better. There we go, got a one-up. I got some awesome Kirby's. Jump with me. I made it all the way up into space. And I got a one-up. I'm already up to eight Kirby's. That's crazy. Probably not gonna need that. Okay. So we fight for four levels, and then we got a boss fight. I think this is the tree. Yes, the tree. So this guy's in freaking every Kirby game. Every Kirby game. Very simple. Suck the apples. I think he's he's literally in in every Kirby game. At least everyone that I've played. I haven't played them all, but um, he's even in, he's even in. Yeah, he's super easy. Get your little wand, get the little Kirby's to dance like usual. Do -do 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 -do. 
So that's that. That's uh, stage one, or level one. Level two is Ice Cream Island. So I'm going to stop the video here. We'll do next part two in level two, Ice Cream Island. Take care, guys. See you next time. Bye.